What's up everyone? John Rettinger from Techno Buffalo here. We've had the iPhone 5 in the office for a little while now. One of the first things I did was speed test. I wanted to know how fast the thing was. Uh, and then I was curious how it compared to the Galaxy S3 on AT&T uh, LTE speed. So I thought, why not show it on camera? AT&T version here, AT&T version here. On the Galaxy S3, we've got four bars of LTE, same amount of bars on the iPhone 5. So let's go ahead and put these two head to head, see which one's faster. So I'll run a full head-to-head -head of everything here, including speed of processor, applications, uh, and core things in the OS. But right now, this is just a speed test of LT in Southern California. Obviously, these speeds could change, depends on where you are, time of day, all that kind of stuff. So totally subjective, but I was curious uh, to test both at the same time. So I'll open speed test here, and let me show you that everything else is closed. All we've got opened is the speed test app, no recent apps there. Um, so speed test is open. Let's open speed test here as well. That's uh, gonna find our closest server, and let's begin the test. Uh, Wi-Fi is turned off on both these as well, so it's straight LTE. And let's see which one, anyone taking bets? See which one's faster? Look pretty close to even iPhone 5, decently faster, almost a whole megabit per second faster. So we got 5.5 down, and a pretty whopping almost six up. So this finished uh, quicker on the iPhone 5. I give AT&T credit, their upload speeds are pretty fast. So 4.72 and 5.26. So a little bit faster uh, on the download on the iPhone 5. Let's go ahead and restart the test and run them one more time and see if we get similar results. So we're getting now about four to five-ish on the Galaxy S3, uh, and about the same on the iPhone 5, a little bit under, and we got just exactly five. Uh, so the moral being, they appear to be just about as fast. I will say uh, that I ran these tests uh, outside uh, on both phones. The iPhone 5 was a bit quicker uh, by not by much. It looks like the LTE radios in each are very comparable. So if you have a 4G LTE Galaxy S3, you wanna know how fast your iPhone 5 might be, and maybe one of your friends uh, has a Galaxy S3, it's gonna be a great test. Uh, not all LTE is created equal. Uh, some of the older LTE phones, their uh, down speeds were much, much, much slower. Uh, something to keep in mind. Anyway guys, stay tuned to Techno Buffalo. We're doing a ton of comparisons. We'll put all these phones head to head, full walkthroughs and first impressions of iOS 6 and the iPhone 5. And anything else you guys wanna see, leave your comments down below. John Rettinger from Techno Buffalo, I'll see you in the next video.